my penny people i am on the road right now i'm headed to a remodel and so many people have questions about how to find a remodel even though there's already videos out there of how to find a remodel i will try to do the best i can to explain it in my own words and to show you firsthand what a remodel store looks like i have found a remodel store I'm headed to that remodel store. But once you do find a store that's 50% off, it will eventually penny on a Sunday before the actual remodel. I know we call them remodels that we go to, but they're not actually remodeling the day of um, the items that penny. No, they're going to remodel the following Sunday. I will show you some of the things to look for out in the parking lot. And inside the store, and then I'll show you how to find it on your app. We have made it here. They have some clothes out front, and I'm gonna be videoing that as I walk by. But I'm here at the remodel store. real tree you guys you see this it don't actually have the 50% off but you can tell that it is 50% off or whoa that's a 70% Ooh. hey you guys this is a key indicator so you have a remodel the 50% off stickers these are letting you know that this is a remodel. There's no stickers on this. I'm looking for more. This door is pretty clean. Okay, here we go. Right here. This is a key indicator that you have a remodel on your hands. This is here again is more stickers. I am going through this door pointing out each sticker each 50% off sticker that they have. If you've noticed, they have several marked. Um, and I say that this is a bad sign due to the fact I've been to a remodel where there were no orange stickers out. Nothing was indicated that it was marked down, even though it was, it, because I scanned it and found out it was. And let me tell you, that remodel morning, or that day it pennied, that Sunday, was a great, it was a great remodel. And for this store to be this clean, and they have almost everything marked, is a key indicator to me that this would not be a good store to go to. Um, these have, I've gotten several of these, and actually, you don't see the orange sticker on these, but these are half price because I've just scanned them. Fifty percent off. The app is your best friend, and this is how you are going to find the most of your remodels. Hey, my penny people, this is your, this is what your home screen looks like on your DG app. Keep in mind to be able to find a remodel, the most reliable source is going to be your app. This is a DG app you can download. 
in the App Store on your phone. It's free. I'm going to be showing you a store within my state that um, has already pennied. So this is how you're going to be able to do this. You're on your you're at, you're at the home screen right now. You're going to go up to the top right corner, change, and let's just say, okay, this is my store here. Well, let's just say this is closest to me. It's, it's popping up a bunch of stores. Okay, I'm going to pick this one. I'm going to make this my location. Now, I'm going to see my list. This is actually a store that's already remodeled. Or is, I'm going to remodel, I guess, Sunday. I'm not sure. But you see, it's a penny. Penny. Full price. Penny. 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 A lot of the stuff on this list is a penny. Some is full price. But, your key indicator, I always like to look at this um, picture frame home decor. This is a 12 frame for $12 usually. So, if it's $6, if it were to be $6, I know I have stumbled across a remodel. I'm going to give you some more examples of the stuff that I go by. At the top of the list, I have these two because this is what I go by here lately, most recently, if you see these orange hoodies, and I know they say a penny now, but just say that they were $8 or $7.50. This means they're half off because they're usually either $14 or $15 in my area. It could differ in your area, but if you know what if it's half off, I know this is probably the same everywhere. You can see it's got $10 on it. It's a penny right now, but just say it had $5 right here. It was $5. It's half off. You know that this store was a remodel. But, see there's underwear and that gives you a visual. I hate some of these. Some of these will not give you a visual. You see that? You'll kind of start learning the prices of each item once you continue to change your store. So like, okay, I'm going to change my store. Okay. Shoot. Let me go right here. I'm going to a different state now. Okay. I'm going to make this my store. Hopefully this video is pretty um, clear. I hope so. I'm videoing with another phone. Okay, you see this, and you see people ask all the time, what does these zeros mean? Does this mean that it's going to remodel, or has it already remodeled? To me, honestly, this looks like, since they don't have this item, because it says zero, which means they don't have it, or this hoodie, they don't have it, this looks to me like it's already a home store Honestly, it's like it's already remodeled. Not saying it couldn't remodel again. It, when you have those zeros, that's what it typically means is they don't have that product in stock. They're out of it. Whatever you want to say. But um, it doesn't mean it's going to remodel. Or it doesn't mean that that's a penny. I know a while back we were scanning stuff. It was just coming up at zero. It was a glitch. That doesn't necessarily mean it's a glitch. It just means they don't have that. And that's on your list. And for that particular store, they don't have a price for it because they don't have it. So, okay, see how that says zero, but then the hoodie says 14. They could just be out of, you know, those fairy lights. You know, they could have sold out of them. That's why it may be zero. $10. I go by these first two because I have them at the top of my list and 
there's two items, there's two different items that are in two different sections. So it just helps me figure out if I have a remodel or not. When you come across one like this, you've missed the Sunday when it pennied. And just, you probably just need to keep looking for another one. You know, I'm mad at myself because I didn't even know about this one. This was in my state. You know? Yeah, and sometimes, see, sometimes you miss some and it's okay. That happens. These are full price. They didn't penny at this particular location. But I'm going to keep them on my list because they have um, went 50% off and pennied at other locations. And it's so exciting to see those pennies like that. But it's basically the same thing. You just, you have a home. You have the deals where you can get the coupons and look at the categories. You have the list. And you have your cart. And with more, you have the your account, cart calculator, stores. Um, there's also something you can do. You can go to filter. And if you guys are looking for a home store... You can just select D, that DG Finds, and it'll pop up. You can hit Apply, and it'll show me the home stores. There is no cheat sheet. There is no list out there highlighted on the internet, you know, circled, telling you, hey, this is a remodel location. You need to be there. You better be glad that that's not the case because, let me tell you, you would have probably... 50, anywhere from 50 to 100 people there or more. But with it being time consuming and not hard, but challenging, it is um, it's safer that way because the less people will be there. Because most of the remodels I've been to lately, there's been between 6 to 12 people there. That's not really a lot. The more remodels you have within a state, the better. The better chances of it being a smaller crowd, I feel like. That's from my experience. Um, people ask for like a UPC list um, or a cheat list for a, a master key list for remodels. There's not one. And you guys, I mean, if you join the group on Facebook, um, People show their products and they post their UPCs and you can you can find what's going to be pinning at um, a certain remodel location. You just got to dig deep. You got to do your research to put that time in to kind of study up and to know the full price of things. Like if you're looking for a remodel and you don't know the full price of the item that's on your list, how are you going to know when it's... 50% off. I know. I hope that makes sense. I hope this be video is beneficial. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video is not too long. It is longer than my usual videos. I'm sorry. It's just a lot of information to try to put in one video. And those people that are struggling to find a remodel or those people that haven't found a remodel, there's plenty of people that's been emailing me and asking me how to find one. There's people that don't know, so I'm hoping that they watch this and they understand and they can find a remodel finally. I hope it helps so much. Thank you guys. You are great. Great penny pals. Love you. Good luck.